This is emotional muscle development. Go ahead and find a spot on the floor, or if you want to sit on a chair, that's fine too. I want you to take the emotion that you've selected and close your eyes and let it float just above you, just above your head and your chest, and allow it to manifest itself to you. What does it look like? What does it feel like? Does it have a scent? Does it have a texture? Just go ahead and key into it for a second with your mind's eye and feel it. And now we're going to put our attention on our body and relax it so that we can deeper feel our feelings. So let that feeling just float above your head and you're going to focus on your body. We're going to start with the crown of our head and we're going to imagine that a halo of golden light is going to touch on the top of it. And wherever it touches, it sends warmth and relaxation. So go ahead and let it touch on the crown of your head. It's going to melt the top of your head. And it's going to move down to your forehead, and your eyebrows, and down into your eye sockets. And it goes all the way through your head, so it's also melting your brain. Your temples, the tops of your ears, to the bridge of your nose, and down into your cheekbones, melting deliciously. And into your mouth cavity and your lips, everything's just melting, melting away into relaxation. And your jaw hinge is melting, your chin is melting. And let it go down into your neck. And feel that first top vertebrae melting away. It's going to melt like molten lava down into the next vertebrae, just melting down. It's going to cause a chain reaction all the way down your neck, melting it. Your voice box melts. Your muscles melt. Everything melts. Until you get to the base of your neck and those muscles that hold your neck to your shoulders start melting. The halo continues down to your shoulders your shoulder blades, it goes into your shoulder sockets, just melting away. And then it goes down both arms. So your upper arms are melting all the way down to your elbows. Your forearms are melting into your wrists, into your hands, into your fingers, just melting away into a pool of liquid relaxation. Now go back up to the top of your chest, to your collarbone, and let that vertebrae melt your, let the, let that halo of light melt your top rib. And down your rib cage, melting each rib again. It just turns into molten lava and melts into the next one below. Down, down, down. So your whole rib cage is melting. Your heart, your lungs, everything inside of your rib cage is melting away. Feels so pleasant and warm. And let that move down into your, your stomach, and down your spine, all the way to the mid-spine, letting each little vertebrae melt, starting the mid-spine. Again, letting those vertebrae turn into, letting those vertebrae turn into molten lava and just melting down into each other. So your spine just disappears and everything's turning to liquid relaxation. And go all the way down into your pelvis, and let your tummy melt and everything inside of there. Let everything inside of your pelvis melt. Let the hip bones melt away. The sacrum in the back, the tailbone, just melting, melting. Your torso is now part of the pool of liquid relaxation. And let the, that sensation of melting, that halo, move into your hip sockets, melting away. And let the sensation go down your thighs. You can feel your thigh bones just turning into molten lava and oozing out and melting. All the way into your knees. Your knees are melting. Your calves are melting. Your ankles are melting. Your feet, your heels, the arches of your feet, your toes are melting away. And now you are just this pool of liquid relaxation. It feels amazing. So take a breath, and then look back up at that feeling that's floating right above your head and chest. And look at that with your mind's eye, key into it. Has it changed at all? 
Is it the same color, the same shape, the same texture? Has it changed? Just notice if it has or if it hasn't. Either way, it doesn't matter. So in just a moment, we're going to allow that emotion to drop into us. And when it does, I can either plunk into us like a rock, or it could rain down like flower petals, it could pour into us like liquid, whatever seems to suit that feeling. You're going to allow it into your body and it's going to move around. So on the count of three, go ahead and let it just fall into your body. One, two, three. Excellent. Now, let that move through your body, slowly churning like ink through water or fish hatching, swimming through a pond or little seedlings sprouting and growing everywhere. Just let it move around and color the water until that is the predominant feeling that you are feeling. And you're going to let it get so strong that in a minute it's going to burst from you and just scoop you up and take you away on a journey. And when it takes you away on that journey, you're going to experience it how it wants to be experienced. You may have a sensation or a kinesthetic feeling. You may have an image, you may have a touch, a smell, sound, past memory that you had, a sense memory, who knows? It's just gonna take you away. So let it get stronger and stronger and on the count of three, it's going to burst from you. One, two, three. And off you go on a journey for the next few minutes, allowing that feeling to lead you. There you go.
Slowly bring your awareness back to the room. Feel your body on the floor. Feel the air on your skin. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. When you're ready, go ahead and open your eyes and sit up.